My sermon's about having faith in the true God. So my grandma has had Parkinson's for the last 16 years. If you don't know what Parkinson's are, it's basically when you have no control of your body shaking. I know I'm afraid that I'm gonna lose him one day. I know that I shouldn't be afraid because I know I serve the God of all of us. It's hard sometimes to believe in God because it feels like he isn't there or he doesn't even love me. I know the stories in the Bible and all that, but I just have to believe it. And so today we're going to learn God with us, God for us, and God working through us. God is with you everywhere you go. God will always be with you through anything you go through. Like me and my grandpa, he's with us all the time. He is also with every one of you. It says in Deuteronomy 31, 6, Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified because of them. For the Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. This verse was written to remind the people of Israel that despite the circumstances, no matter good or bad, he was with them. God is with you, but also for you. This means God protects us through the hard times. I have a story that might help us remember that God is with for you. I think everyone here has heard or even knows about the story of Daniel. Daniel, the leader of the advisors, was a man who believed in God and followed the Lord's commands. The other men did not like Daniel, so they devised a way to get rid of Daniel. These men knew that Daniel served the God of Israel. They told King Darius to make a new law, which states that they can only pray and worship to King Darius. So Daniel knew the new law, but committed his heart towards God. So he prayed three times a day with his windows open. One day the men saw Daniel worshiping and praising the Lord. So they brought accusations against him to King Darius. The king was disappointed because he favored Daniel. The king threw Daniel into the lion's den. But Daniel still had faith in the Lord that he will, because he has a purpose for everything. So later an angel of the Lord came down from heaven and closed the mouth of the lions. The story of Daniel is about teaching us about God's faithfulness and promises. God is with you, for you, and also working through you. God is using your story to show his faithfulness. God has let my family go through this hardship to express his faithfulness so that others can find hope, faith, in Christ. To close is that God will never leave you nor forsake you in any situation. Also, my challenge to you is whatever is going on in your life, you need to know that God is with you, God is for you, and God is working through you. Thank you. Woo! Come on. Come on.